In this video, I show you how to base boost in CapCut. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like, and let's jump straight into this guide. The first thing you need to do once you're on CapCut is to either go and create a new project or go and open up an existing one. So I've just gone and created a new project with this video here. The next thing I'm going to do is just go mute the sound in this video here because I don't want any sound in it because I just want to have the base boost music. So I'm gonna go and turn this down just like so and press the tick button. Then what you need to do is go and unset the video by pressing on the back arrow in the bottom left like so. Now what we need to do is go and add the song which you want to go and bass boost. So go and tap add audio or just audio in the bottom of CapCut just like so. Then you can go and press on sounds or go and choose whatever music you want. Then I'm just gonna go and choose a random track from the vlog section. So I'm now gonna go and add this one here called Blue Moon, just like so. So as you can see, we've now added it. Now the next thing you need to do is go and decide which section of song you want to go and bass boost and just have in your video. So in this case, I'm just gonna go and get a section from the middle like so. Then you want to go and tap on it once you found where you want the piece to start, press split, and you want to go and delete what you don't want. So I don't want this first part here. So I'll tap on it and scroll along and go and tap on delete like so. Then here's the music here. Then what you need to do is hold your finger on it and then we can drag it back to the start like so. It may glitch a bit, just hold it there. And here we are. Now, what we then want to do is go and cut it and split it where we want the track to end. So I want it to end here. So tap on it and press split like so, and then scroll along to delete and make sure you've got the piece selected. You want to go and delete like so and tap delete. Now this is the piece which I want to go and bass boost. So now what we need to do is go and tap on it once. Then once you've increased the volume, make sure it's still selected and go and press on voice effects like so. Then what you want to do is go and tap on retro, uh, the fourth option here, and then go and tap on megaphone. Or you can just scroll along like so and you can get through all of the effects. I'm gonna use this megaphone one, so I'll tap on it, um, and then make sure the strength is on full, and then go and tap on the tick in the bottom right like so. And then after you've applied the effect, then what you want to do is make sure the track is still selected like so, and scroll along right to the end until you go and see the option for copy, then go and press on copy like so, and it's then gonna go and duplicate it. And then what you want to do is hold your finger on it again, and then drag it down, and then along like so. So we're sort of stacking these up. And then what I'm going to do is do it one more time. So I'm now going to go and press on copy once again, and it's going to go and duplicate it again. And we want to go and put that as the third audio track down here. And we'll now move it along like so. And there we go. And make sure they all start at the same time. Now we can go and play it back and it's basically going to be bass boosted. 